Oh, sh**. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. What a bitch, it's Rumple Titty Skin in the house. Yeah. I look like a saggy fucking sack of potatoes. Rubbed with mayonnaise and mustard. Mmm. Mm. Let's see. Oh, wait. Oh, dude, I think the Jinjo is out this way. Tell you what. Let's get the Kazoopal and go back this way. I gotta say, playing as, dra playing as Kazooie on her own is pretty awesome. Playing as Dragon Kazooie on her own, well, that's pretty awesome, too. Yeah. Because you get to breathe fire. No. Ah. Right. Not allowed. Let's see. Let's get There's one. a burn ban. It's too hot here. <laughs> what? It's too hot. You might start a fire. Oh, God. I, I, think, I can think <laughs> of somebody who might like this level. Ooh. <laughs> I don't need to say. I think, uh... I summon the Dark Lord. Hey, guys. What, what up, uh, S-Man? Hey, uh, much. I, do you like my, uh, my homeland? Isn't it wonderful? It's pretty. Hey, you want to join our fire blood orgy we're going to have <laughs> later? Yeah. It's going to be... Who's going to be there? Uh, Santa Claus? Santa Claus, me, Buddha, and Easter Bunny? The Easter Bunny, the Tooth Fairy, the Sandman. Mom? Uh, yes, my mother would be No, no, there. not your mother. Mom. Who's mom? Mom. What, what are you talking Everyone about? Everyone knows mom. Uh, what? Wait, is it cool to know mom? <laughs> okay, <sighs> James is back. Thank you. <laughs> I freed him. Uh, you know how it is. That's one thing I remember as a kid. It's like, do, do you ever, like, remember during... You, you know how, like, for a while as a kid, like, you're more... <laughs> what the, I thought I just killed him! I thought you did too, what Jesus. the fuck? Okay, you know what? What do you want? So, you remember... <laughs> so, I remember as a kid, like, I was, like, actually really insecure about myself as a kid. Were okay. you at all? A kid? No, not really. Really? Not really. Oh, for real? Memory. Oh, wait, what the... F no! Wrong... Oh, thank you, Shrek Gargoyle. You s to... I guess maybe when I was, like, a late elementary school. Yeah, that's what I mean, like... Oh, okay, I was, like... I was thinking, like, a little kid. I was, like, no. No, no, not little kid. Like, elementary, middle school... Not not middle school very much. Really? Yeah, early fucking... Uh, <laughs> kind of funny story. Mm, to put it nicely, I'm gonna use some different words here. Mm -hmm. One time, my sister said that I looked like a fucking loser, and... Uh, and then I changed all my clothes and shit, and I, like, totally bought in. I was like, I'm gonna dress like a badass motherfucker. And then I, uh, had a lot of friends in school, and then I was, uh, pretty, like, full of myself for a little while. Are you, for real? <laughs> yeah, for real. Wait, what like, grade was this? Seventh and eighth grade or so. So, be, so because your sister insulted you, you decided in sixth to... sixth grade. Oh, uh, wow. Well, yeah. you know, that's, that's the... If eight. anything, it was kind of a good thing. Yeah, I that's... gained a lot of confidence. <laughs> I was like, fuck you, bitch, I'm cool as shit. So, so wait, so define you dressed a certain way. Oh, I, I was just like a fucking nerdy fuck before that. Like, I would wear, like, shorts that were, like, way above the middle of my thigh. Like, oh. up to my belly button. I'd wear, like, fucking weird nerdy-ass vests and shit. I had some dorky-ass glasses. And then I pretty much just went to, like, uh, I don't want to name drop all the brands, but just, like, a bunch of brands that were popular in fucking middle school uh, and just got okay. a bunch of new clothes and stopped acting such so fucking dorky and then mm. after that i was like wow i'm a cocky fucking fuck and then i stopped doing that and here i am back to normal so just a nerdy fuck but that's why i dress like not like a nerdy fucking fuck so basically so her insult was mainly directed at how you dressed right yeah okay so she didn't even say fuck she yeah yeah she just said <laughs> you look like a fucking dork uh, okay. She didn't say that, but she, she probably doesn't even lines. remember she said it. It mm. was like in passing, but it really hurt my feelings at the time. And I was like, wow. I was like, wow, I am a fucking dork nerd. And then I, uh, yeah, I was like, well, I'm going to do some shit about this. And then I uh, became very popular. Also because really I hit popular, fucking, huh? I, not like super, super popular or anything, but I was like uh, the first kid in school to like hit six feet tall. You know, I was six feet tall in seventh grade. Yeah, dude, we're, so, you and I were both pretty tall dudes. I'm, we're, you're like six foot. Six feet. You're six feet. Yeah. I, I'm so. Oh, so you hit your uh, height limit in at... seventh grade? Yeah. Ah, okay. And I've met other people who tell me that shit, and they just say that. I have fucking picture proof. I talked to my sister, my other sister, who did not say that about this. I was like, yeah, look, in seventh grade, you were, you know, done growing at this time because she's a lot older than me. 
I was like, look, you are, uh, you're an inch shorter than me. And in seventh grade, I'm an inch taller than you in this picture. Meaning I have to be six feet tall. And she's like, holy shit, you're right. So I actually was six feet tall at the end of seventh grade. Okay. Yeah, it's wow. crazy. And then I just stopped growing. So all my friends who normally I look down on, like uh -huh. in my memory, they're still shorter than me. But now they're all like fucking 6'3 and 6'4. But I still think they're shorter than me. Oh. Uh. Because <laughs> in middle school, they're all like 5'6, you know? That's your, that's your memory of them. Yeah. Oh, I see. It's weird. Huh. Well, all right then. Huh. Yeah. Um, what, what, what was... Oh, the reason I asked you about this was because... <laughs> Sorry, I like totally got off topic. No, 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 dude. That, that was really interesting. Thank you for sharing that. Yeah. Um, so, uh... Like, I guess, <laughs> see, when when Satan was in here earlier, he said, Satan. you know how he said, it's it's cool to, is it cool to know mom? I, I just remember as a kid, I was thinking, oh. you know how, like, when, when before you, like, know what's socially acceptable or, uh -huh. like, you have more self-esteem about yourself, it's right. like, uh, will they think I'm cool if I do this? Oh. Like, it's, you, did, you, sure. did you ever at any point ask someone, am I cool? Uh, no. Because I know I did at least a couple times. I don't think I asked them, but... Uh, okay. I'm sure I asked them, like, the equivalent, like, am I a fucking dork? Mm. Am I a fucking nerd? Something like that. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm sure. Mm. I remember I asked some kid in sixth grade if he thought I was fat, because I didn't know if I was fat or not. Oh. And I was, like, severely underweight. Like, severely. I just had no fucking clue. Wait a minute. Oh, shit. Did I just screw this up? I Is don't know. the jiggy thing? Please be there. Phew! Nice. Because when I hit, you know, I wasn't six feet tall in sixth grade, but I was pretty close. I was probably like, you know, 5'10". Okay. Um, and when I hit six feet tall, I was 135 pounds. Mm. So I was a skinny fuck. And you thought you were fat? I didn't know. Okay. I didn't know. And I was like, hmm. It was at that stage right after my sister said, you're a nerd. And I'm like, well. Am I also fat? Is it because I'm it? a like socially awkward fuck? And I dress weird, and I'm fat? No, it's just because I'm a socially awkward fuck, and I dress weird. Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad you learned that about yourself. Yeah. That, that's that's just a tricky thing when you're young. like Because yeah. you're still figuring things out and how the world mm -hmm. works. There's, there's no like instruction booklet you're given right when you come out the womb that says, yeah. this is this, this is currently socially acceptable, oh, this totally. is what you need to know about this, this is what you need to know about this and that. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I mean, when I was in 7th and 8th grade and ninth grade and shit like that, I played mm -hmm. a lot more into like, oh, I'm going to act this way a little more. I'm because act I, cool. Yeah, I was like, uh, I know people will like me more if I do this. And then I, it reached a point, and I noticed other people were still doing it in college, like at university. People still act that way, especially people who were like, not to say anything bad about rushing fraternities and sororities, but I noticed generally people like that were... Um, Still acting that way. Oh, still just, acting like narcissistic and... Or just like they, they were acting a certain way for other people rather than themselves. Yeah, yeah. And now I've gotten to the point, like, when I was at university, I, like, got way more to the point where I was just like, I don't fucking care if I'm an awkward fuck. I don't care if I should act this way to be normal. I'm just like, I just don't give a shit. So, yeah, dude. <laughs> I think a lot of the people I interact with now and meet, like, uh, I can be awkward as fuck around. Uh -huh. Just because I just like don't. me, <laughs> yeah. You like to make spread that awkwardness too, and make yeah. me feel awkward. <laughs> yeah, like I just don't care. Like for yeah, me, dude. it's kind of funny to make other people feel awkward. Mm -hmm. Not always, but sometimes. It, it's just so I just like to push people's buttons, I guess. No, dude. Like I think most people realize this, but like the, I didn't really learn this until like. I have four lower teeth and no upper teeth. <laughs> I can eat a lot of pretzels. Oh my god. They, they probably, they have like woof, never mind. Anyways, woof as I was saying, woof, fact, fact, mouths. Um, so, oh wait, the scores, oh, you have to get the least amount of points. Oh shit. I wasn't re, I was too busy oh listening god, to you. Oh my god, James, learn how to read. <clears throat> Damn it. Great. Is that what you have to do? Okay, so what I was saying was, um, yeah, you, it's, it's the opposite here. You have to get the least amount of points. So, um, I, I feel like most people, uh -oh. like, eventually in, like, high school and college, they realize, eh, you know what, there's, there's being yourself, and then there's being socially acceptable. Mm -hmm. Like, if you sit, if you do something weird, or that's socially unacceptable, then, you know, you should try not to do it. But then there's things that are just, like, just being yourself. And some, sometimes people will judge you for being yourself, or for doing something that's socially unacceptable and it's like where's the difference i think that's just kind of a challenge of life you know like oh it totally where's is. Is, where's is it and i think it's also like what you're okay with yeah like it, everybody's different too like life is life is complicated that's the simple 
way to sum up what I'm saying. If you just goaltend yourself now, you'd win. Um, go what? Goaltend yourself. Goaltend. Block them from shooting into your goal. Um, oh, that's... Ah, oh, you're right. So, so, like, line of sight, like... Draw a line from where they are to you, and that would be the shot they're going to make. Because they're computers, so they shoot, I think, directly on the middle. Okay. I think. Or towards the middle. Oh, that guy's going to try and shoot. Uh, uh, uh. Nice. Oh. Damn it. Oh, well, okay. I'm still winning. Yeah. Hmm. You know what? Now that I think, I could be making a complete ass of myself right now. Oh? Because I'm pretty sure the goal is to have the least amount of points. Yeah, you have the least amount of points. Yes! Okay, the good music played. That means I was right. So yeah, basically, to sum up what we were talking about... Yeah. Masturbate in public. 